welcome one and all to a brand new series on the channel this is the final approach and yes we are playing on final approach that's a really clever play on words isn't it yeah i've, I've done really well with that one so this is going to be a stock playthrough i'm going to be looking at uh, just just playing stock i very rarely just play a pure stock it's actually a rarity for me um the settings are pretty much moderate but i've taken off crew respawn because i don't like zombies i don't like zombies in my team how are we doing gene Gene wants to talk to me. I'm not. I'm not going to talk to you there. I'm going to go to the uh, the mission control. We've got some missions. What do we want? We're going to launch our first vessel. We're going to gather some scientific data. That's what we want. We're going to go here now. One of the aims of this is to actually look around and see some of the new stuff. But obviously, there's limited new stuff to start with. Um, the other thing is, and I'm going to do this while I talk. Uh, the other thing is that um, I want to. Um, do a bit more sort of talking as I'm doing um, because I, you know in, in other series I do a lot of speedy up I do all sorts of other things and um, I just want to try and do something a little different um, so I will probably speed up builds but I'm going to try and do live missions and that might mean that we 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 put the missions on a few different episodes I'm not entirely sure we're going to call this the carrot because why not is carrot with two hours or one hour carrot two r's looks better well if it isn't it's it's a bit like dessert and desert isn't it the dessert launch pad in kerbal if you haven't seen that that's an old one actually well not actually that old anyway um so off we go we'll have that i'm gonna save that as the carrot i suppose we should put something on it to actually fire it uh, a solid flea booster and we're going to drop you down to the random 30 no i don't like that 27 27 is a good random number we like that i should put fins on you i should also make sure that we change this to owen risky that's a good idea and um actually i want it i want you to fire sooner i want you to fire at 1500 i think i think that's what i want yeah i think that's what i want a little bit higher just i'm just paranoid i'm paranoid if anybody saw my um back to basics series which is one of my first series on the channel you will see why i have done that because um yeah me and first flight's not a good idea right yeah what can i do with storage storage this is something new to me i've not really done much storage so you've got a parachute jetpack we don't need a jetpack when i've got into space parachute do i can i put that back in though yeah i can okay um parachute you can't eva at the moment because i haven't paid for it so there's no point having a parachute you can't even eject i don't think you can anyway can you is that a possibility i can't even check can i we could have a look can we eject is there an eject button if there is an eject button tell me there's an eject button that would be really good um, i'm going to take the parachute just in case so jeb jeb has the parachute i believe it's in Jeb's inventory. There's inventory space there. It's in Jeb's inventory, right? So he has a parachute. Um, we've got this ready. I'm not going to put fins on it. Um, and I think we're ready to go. So save it and launch it. And we're about two and a half minutes into the episode. And we're launching our first craft. Isn't that wonderful? So, yeah, I'm going to play through a little bit and uh, and see what's going on. We're going to keep the episodes reasonably short. We're doing EVA with Jeb first because we've got to get some science because I want to get going I don't want to do a how fast can I go um, but you know what? I've done this wrong reset that board get a crew report first sea monsters get the crew report there we go then EVA right then you can EVA report take that then you can collect take the data out of there then you can store the data back in and I didn't put any goo pods on this and that's going to annoy me because I should have. However, I will learn. I will learn. So, that one there. Full thrust. We might send up another one of these just with the goo pods. Um, and let us just... I think we're ready. Let's fire that off. I want to go at a slight angle, but not too much. Because I want to just... Uh, I want to give myself time to uh, to come back down, shall we say. I want to slow down a bit. Um, and we want to do a crew report there we go a bit more science so i should have enough from that and recovering the craft to get the first couple of nodes i hope well one hopes doesn't one so parachute gets too much at about 300 so i need to be below 300 when the parachute will deploy right that's good to know 
there's the island airfield, isn't that nice? We'll activate the parachute. So, turn off that. There we go. Oh, it didn't, it did it a lot lower. So, that's nice. Ah, oh, so the parachute has deployed nice and low. That's good. Going to slow us down. We're going to speed this up. Um, and it's going to come down in the water, I'm guessing. So, island airfield. That's a classic. I remember that before they actually updated it. Um, interesting thoughts going through the mind because it's the 10 year anniversary of KSP. What were you doing? How did you find out about KSP? What was the thing that triggered KSP into your world? Maybe in the next episode or maybe the next launch I will tell you about mine because it's a bit of an odd one actually. It is a strange one. Um, but KSP, yeah, big journey it's been on. A little bit, you know, if you look at it now and you think, oh, it's it's quite a good game. The, the, well, it is a good game, but the uh, the actual design, the, the look of it is good. You know, you add mods and it makes it nicer. But how you doing, Jeb? You okay? Um, but compared to the, the original versions, I mean, I think uh, I remember playing 0.7, um, which I actually played after playing later versions, and it was one of those things where you go back and have a look. Um, but I think the version I may have probably started the demo I played I think it was probably 1.16 or something like that possibly before that I remember 1.18 and 19 being sort of things that came out I remember uh, 21 coming out as well I remember when water was toxic and a nightmare so there we go we recover the craft Jeb first Kerbal to fly didn't look too unhappy about that I'm not sure right let's have a look what have we got what have we got have we got all the stuff we have got a 25 science love it what can I do with 25 science? I can get one of you and, oh no, that's a choice. Can I, oh, I think I can. I think I can get basic rocketry. I can get engineering. And can I get you? I can. Cool, so I've got some extra science gizmos. Now that's that's a, that's a, a lifesaver. So we've got service bit, uh, pressure barometer, radiators because i need those obviously we could mount the radiators somewhere and we've got radio parachutes right we've got drogue parachutes so let us have a look at our craft in fact no what am i doing don't look at the craft figure out what your mission is sea monsters figure out the mission conduct observations i don't really want to do that take a crude flight below that i don't know if i can do that um launch site with a hammer launch site with a swivel oh I really want to get both of those which one pays me the most and gives me the most they're both the same I think you know what we're going to do that and we're going to do that um, yes because I don't want to lose them I want to get both we're going to launch the hammer first because I want to get all that science before I leave the atmosphere because the, leaving the atmosphere will be the bit where not having a scientist on board it's a problem so let's look at our original carrot um we're going to take that off there where's the hammer there's the hammer uh, but we now have decouplers which are important because this thing is too heavy to do much with right um thrust on you what's my what's my my thingy doodle let's get this down here sort my staging always check your staging right what's my thrust Thrust on curb in 1.7. I do not need to thrust that high at launch. Thank you very much. Oh, it uh, it takes a while to update, doesn't it? 1.3, 1.4. Let's take it to 30%. There we go. Right. I don't want um, I don't want fins on this. I'm going finless, fin free, fin fin free, fin fresh, fin fresh. Fantastic finish. Um, it sounds like I'm actually supporting the Finnish nation on that one. Right, we want pressure barometer. I'm going to go for two of you because I do not have a scientist. Well, I do have a scientist, but I do not trust my scientist to be on the craft. So put two of you on. Two thermometers. And uh, two of you. I'm running out of space. Right, how are we going to do that? You know what? We're going to put you up at the top here. You have two of you there. And then I'm gonna have uh, you there, put you there. We'll, we'll figure you in a minute. And I want to put a couple of drogue parachutes, I think, on, or one drogue parachute. Where are they? They're gonna be in utility. I find parachutes in utility a bit weird. Like, should, should they not be, 
should they not be in a parachute thing they're quite important i think they should have their own section i think probably because of playing um mods a lot you get used to the idea of parachutes sort of you know real shoots real shoots wonderful mod uh, parachutes having their own sort of space so yeah do not have action groups so i need to be able to access these so let's stick them up a bit like so can i click on them yes i can let's have a look at this can i pull this up and across yes i can we're going to dump you in like so so what we're doing is we're taking the uh, the pilot space there we just we, they don't need that much we're giving them extra we're giving them extra space we're just going to slim it down a bit yeah so inside there if you just imagine there's just some bulges now so as long as our pilot fits in that gip there which we've seen they climbed out jeb climbed out last time he only took the middle bit um i don't need two of you um i could have two of you am i going to do an eva yes i'm going to do an eva i could be cheeky and just stick these at the bottom that would be um odd that would be an odd design choice let's do that because i've uh, i've 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 lost the i've lost the faith i think there we go um and we'll just uh where are you gonna go at you're gonna go at about three thousand i think because i want you dragging straight away before my main shoots open uh spread angle and you're gonna deploy when risky okay wonderful i think that's good i think that's what we want so this should take us near the upper atmosphere we should potentially get into the upper atmosphere with this and we're going to have a bit of a, a wonk on it and um i should have done an eva after we landed in the water would have got more science oh jeb right now traditionally i always fly val second and val tends to die uh in my saves for some reason val is the one that dies um i don't know what, what are your saves like i don't know uh, for some reason val just i'm an originalist that the first three and then val's been added on and i want val to do well i i do truly i like the concept of val but she always seems to be the one that dies and i'm not entirely sure why that is well i'm probably because she gets the risky second mission so anyway let's go so we don't really want to escape the atmosphere with this one i want to just skim the atmosphere to the top and i can't shut down the solid booster which is always going to be a problem so we're going to do from the launch pad because we can we're going to get one of these log the pressure keep it log temperature keep it um do i want a mysterious goo i could send somebody out to get one next time or i can get a next time I, when i send a scientist up it's actually oh go on climb up. why are you falling down that's what's going on there that's not good so take data take data um store the data uh, i don't need to do an eva will i do i do it do i do any eva no i've got no data to come from there so we'll board you right valve we're gonna go left i think i think that's a good idea for our second flight off we go press the z button if we go taking off just tilt just a smidgen just a smidgen that's what I want to do, just just like that. And we're going to pop this on because I want to keep an eye on... Ooh, a lot of Z-fighting there. Ooh, is that one of those... Do I need to check a save or check a setting somewhere? I do think I've got ground scatter quite high, so I might have to turn that down if it's going to continue Z-fighting. But it seems to be when I'm near the ground. And that has been something that has been a problem in the past with Kerbal and me for some reason. Oh, now look, that's locked. So that means that those obviously i haven't got because i haven't got the the tech ah you know what it shows you how rarely i play um uh, how rarely i play stock because i cannot see that that's brilliant so we've got fuel going up we're not actually going that high are we should probably um observe the mystery goo la castle and uh we should probably get that keep that and i want to get that I want to log temperature, keep that. And I want to uh, log pressure, keep that. And how are we doing? We're not actually going to get into the... Uh, I don't know what the flying high is, actually. I don't know what the requirement is to get flying high. So this will be interesting because... Um, is it 30? Is it 25? Is it... Right, so I get that got a crew report over, over over grasslands okay ah now what are these are these biome specific C 
Kerbin or flying at Kerbin. Okay. So let's go up to when we're at like 25. I wonder if 25 is, I can never actually remember. I, I play sort of modded so much that like RP1 and stuff. Um, Kerbin's upper atmosphere. Oh, good. Keep data. Observe mystery. So 25 is probably it. 25 is probably the border, which is nice to know. And I could have checked that actually, to be fair. I could check that. We'll get rid of the capsule. We'll uh, do that and we will orientate ourselves for return. We're going to come, not the mountains, not into the mountains. This is, this is how she dies. This is how every single time she dies. It's like, I don't normally come this way. Oh, hold on, the parachutes are out, good. So I don't normally come this way. I normally go towards the water and she dies in the water. And if I go near the mountains, she dies in the mountains. I'm sure, Val, that you and I at some point in a past life or something have actually had a problem with each other because I just do not seem to be able to keep you alive. If you land here and don't die, this I think will be the first time in about three attempts with with, with Kerbal since you arrived that, you, that you've that you managed to do it. It's the first time out of three. And I literally, I think I've played the game three times in stock since you were added. And this is the third time. And this is the first time. So it's twice that you've had died in the rocks once and in the water once. In fact, you probably died more when I've just been messing around. Yeah, you don't even look that happy. You should be ecstatic. You should be ecstatic. I mean, you, I know you're upside down. I'm, I mean, I, I get that. I mean, the upside down bit is probably not the best. You know what? I think we'll just... Uh, we can we can cut that now, can't we? We can cut that and we can, we can cut... Can we... I think you've... Oh, that's why. There we go. Sorry about that. Oh, now you're happy. Oh, good. Yeah, we only needed to stop having you hanging upside down. That was my fault. Yeah, that very much my fault. Look at that flag, lovely. So there's the Mun. We're going to go there soon. Um, this episode is going to go probably to about 20 minutes at most. So as soon as this lands, we're actually going to end it. And then I can edit it and upload it and people can not watch it, uh, which will be fun for me. All right, coming down. I don't know. Why are you spinning? Why are you spinning? Like seriously, can we just? Thank you, thank you. That's better. Use a bit of actually. What's the energy like? We have got loads of electric charge. I've got monoprop. Oh, because monoprop is in the EVA packs now, isn't it? There we go. Still got that ground scatter issue. So I think before the next episode, I need to play around and try and maybe put a sandbox episode in and see if I can get rid of this Z fighting. And that probably is just something to do with a setting somewhere. I'll probably drop the shader settings down or something. And there we go. Right recover that we'll have a quick look at what we've got and then next time we'll go from there and see what i think we'll probably go for orbit next time or at least escaping the atmosphere lol the science 53 53 science some money back got loads of money and valve's done well right so from me until next time have a great one